Hello, today I'm here with a new video and today I am here with a face-off and I love doing face-offs and this time it's a freeway face-off. It's me, Annette and Debbie. I will of course leave both of the channels up here in the card, down in the description and also the videos, their videos down in the description. And this face-off is created by Danielle Smith. I will leave her channel down in the description as well. And this face-off is, we take the same palettes, the same shades, and do our own makeup. And if you haven't checked out Annette or Debbie, you should really do that. I have collabed with Annette before. She's a friend of mine here on YouTube. I love her videos. I watch all of her videos. 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 So you should really check her out. And Debbie, she is a new friend of mine here on YouTube. And... She is such a kind person. I like that so much. She's really caring and she's really kind. So you should also check her out. And she has an amazing palette collection. So the palette we chose for this face off is the Magic Palette by Juve's Place. And I got the biggest one. And we have six shades. And a little story about this. I'm going to swatch the shade for you. Um... So yeah, here comes the swatches. So first we picked those five, or Annette randomly got these five colors for us. And yeah, they are all shimmers. And it was like, how are we going to pull this off? But then we agreed that we were going to take a sixth shade. And I am willing to... <laughs> <laughs> Blame Annette for this. I hope you agree with me, Deppy. I guess you are not Annette. But the sixth shade we got um, was this one. Also a shimmer shade. So we got six shimmer shades. But I actually think I know what I want to do. I... Uh, yeah. I'm going to track the try to make the best of this situation. And I like excuse my red face but it's so darn hot in Sweden today. It's 28 degrees. I'm so sweaty. So okay. I I think I just changed my mind about what I want to do. Okay, I will start with Nubia this one, the gold one and take it in my inner corner. Not in my inner corner but I don't even know if this brush is going to be okay with this. Like just in here. This maybe works. And I think to have like all shimmer shades for palette bingo, it maybe can work for Yves Place. I don't know other brands that it would work with. I have done a uh, Evia's Place Week on my channel and there I did only shimmer look but then I only used three shades so yeah okay so that's Nubia I think I'm happy with this maybe just a little bit more here and then I want to take this Buso the green one and this has a little bit of gold in it so I take this in here. You can actually see what I'm doing. I don't have to tell you. And I don't think that anybody of us was happy when we drew the colors, but... It's fun to challenge yourself, okay? okay I think something like this. And then I want to take Yara, this one. Put it on my outer corner. And this is not that green. Maybe it is. But this is like a cooler green. And the other one was a little bit warmer. But I actually think that I am able to smudge this out in my crease. Maybe it's not the best blending work I have ever done. But it's only shimmers. It feels like I want to intensify this gold. 
it feels like this is going easier than I thought. <sighs> Thanks God. Then I would take this Vi. Oops. And put it in my outer corner. Yes, too. Deepen this down a little bit. Maybe this is not possible. Maybe this and I will try to have some here in my crease. Okay, this was maybe not the best decision. Because it feels like this takes over from Yara. But I just guess that we have to live with this. I don't really know what I think about this. I think the gold is too much in there but I also think that I need to have the other eye, my base and my brows to like get the full look. I hope. I think it's so hard to see like different shades when you're doing only shimmers but I wanted something dark and this is pretty dark. So I will fix my other eye or do the same on the other eye fix my base and my brows and then I will come back and we have then two shades left the two pink ones so I know what I want to do I will get a look maybe shady look I don't know but I will get a look from these so I will come back with the other eye and my base on okay so the face and the brows are on and it feels a little bit better if I'm going to be honest so we have two shades left. We got Suba and Olsen. And one little tip, if you're going to buy the magic palette, don't buy this motherfucking ass big palette because it's only in the way. So I will take these on my lower lash, of course. So I'm going to start with Suba. I think this got a little bit of gold to it as well. I'm going to take this out here. I maybe need to spray this. Okay, so I usually don't spray my Yuga Place. But now I am doing this on my low lash. And why did I take this super big brush? Because now I'm poking my eye. And then I will take this one and put on the inner half of my lower lash. And I will of course spray this as well. And now I really got glitter specks in my eye. It feels it's too far down. Here, but I don't think I can do anything about it. No, because then I mess up my base. Why do I do this to myself? So, okay, I am going to do the other eye and try to fix this with some loose powder or something. So, I will be back when I have done the other eye, put on some mascara something in my watch line and also a lippy and then I come back so I actually think I am done for my watch line I took this one from Colourpop it's crust CRSSD no idea for my lips I took a matte liquid matte lip liquid from the body shop and this is Nairobi Camellia I love this shade and yeah this is the finished look and if I look a little bit strange underneath my eyes I try to fix the pink with some powder but it doesn't look good so I'm sorry for that. But this was my face off with six shimmers from the Magic palette by US Place and I actually think that I am satisfied with this look. I like this one and it was easier than I thought. I think with UVS you can blend a shimmer shade. So thanks God we got six shimmer with a UVS Place palette because else I think it would be hard. So this was my face off with Annette and Debbie and I will of course leave their channels up here down in the description and also their videos. And I want to thank you Annette for bringing us three together to do this collab. And it's so fun to doing a collab with you, Debbie. And you have to check both of their videos out and see how they did. 
it's going to be so fun to see how they did. I, it feels like either we did it pretty similar or totally different. I really don't know. So I really hope you liked this video and if you're not subscribing to my channel, please do so you don't miss any of my videos and I hope I will see you in the next one. Bye!